What is going on, FT3000? Back in the place to be, and welcome to Super Bullet Break. So finally, we have some waifu collectors making their way on over, hold on, let me check my notes, to Steam, that's cool, PlayStation 4, what? And the Nintendo Switch, believe it or not, no mobile. In this game, there are over 160 waifus for you to collect with no microtransactions, but do keep in mind, this game will run you 20 bucks up front. But all of the characters can be obtained via gameplay. Play. What gameplay? Allow me to show you. So let's go ahead and jump on in. We're gonna go ahead and do this bad boy let's play style. All right, so here we are in the main gameplay map and basically the objective is to go to this castle and defeat the boss. Now, in order for me to do that, I need to carve a pathway through these nodes, right? And some of these nodes are battles. Um, some of these nodes have you talking to NPCs to hopefully get buffs, upgrades. There are some random treasure chests. That little coffee cup over there will give me heals. And what I'm trying to do through all of these nodes is to try to craft the strongest most powerful deck that I think is strong enough to defeat the boss in this castle so if you think of games like slay the spire it's very similar to that all of these nodes are gonna give me lots of different upgrades items different perks I can discard cards etc etc and like I said once again I'm trying to build the best deck possible to defeat the boss all right so here we are in combat let's go ahead and break this all down in the bottom left hand corner of your screen that is my main character as you can see she has has 110 HP. This HP does not replenish as you defeat stages. So you have to really min max and manage this character's HP in order to have as much HP as possible for when you fight the boss, right? Um, the enemies do not attack your waifus, they attack your main character. So that's very paramount that you keep her as healthy as possible so that way you can get to the castle. Now, in order to defeat enemies, you use these little waifus down here, and they have a few different aspects here that are noteworthy, right? So let's go ahead and use the fluffy buffer as an example of how combat works in this game um, so you have the number four there right that represents the fluffy buffers cost um, the five next to the sword is how much damage it does so it's gonna do five damage um, the range is single target so he's only gonna be able to attack one enemy and then finally you see this little green heart that's a heal so if you see that green heart on any other character card or waifu that lets you know basically at a glance even if you don't know anything else that what that character does this is gonna be a character card that will heal your main character and you can see right here he's gonna heal two times all right now before we attack with fluffy buffer the final thing that you need to know is how the cost of each card correlates to the movement bar now this is where all the strategery comes in so you can see right up here fluffy buffer costs four so that's gonna move my movement bar four closer to the enemy's turn and you can see right over here, Marcel is five, Spec Rose is seven. You see how close that moves me to the enemy? So the overall strategy in this game is to try to use as many of your own cards as possible before the enemy can act, right? And that's all about kind of manipulating your costs and your movement bar. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use Dinky Devil. He costs three, does seven damage. He's gonna cause me to discard a card though. I'm gonna go ahead and discard the Fluffy Buffer because it's a heal and I don't really need a heal right now. Um, from here, I'm gonna go ahead and cast Haru, which does a six damage, plus gives my main character a shield. Once again, keep in mind, you are trying your best to mitigate how much damage your main character takes, because once that HP is gone, you have to heal it, right? Um, let's go ahead and do double my current shield, four costs, does six damage, that's gonna double my current shield. So I have 110 HP plus a 12 shield. Now from here, as you can see, this is my last turn. Once I do one more action, it's time for the enemy to go. Now, the very best way for me to end my turn is to use a burst card. Now, burst cards are kind of interesting. The more cards you play before a burst card increases the damage. So this is gonna allow me to do 11 chunky damage right there. And now my turn is over and now I'm getting smacked by enemies. Now, once again, keep in mind, your waifus, your cards, your creatures, they don't take damage. The only thing that takes damage is your main character. So once again, super important for you to take care of your main character. Um, so let's, once again, I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go for armor here. So my main character has 95 HP for armor. I then I'm gonna once again use the Dinky Devil. That's gonna do nine damage, forcing me to discard. I'm gonna discard my heal. Very nice. I know discard sounds bad, but he's such a low cost card. 
it allows me to kind of shove in some extra moves, you know what I mean? There goes the burst card for 11 damage. All right, so we have a new card on the board, Nanette. So let's take a look at her, right? So she costs seven, so kind of expensive. She's gonna do seven damage and allow me to draw a card. But the most important thing is her range. Every other person that I've showed you so far only has a single target range, but Nanette can do a three target range there. So it does a lot more damage there for your buck. Um, from here, oh, dude, I should have did a shield. So I could have doubled it. Um, you know what? We're going to go ahead and just use the Nanette once again. That's going to do damage to both of them. Enemy turn. I'm going to get smacked in the face there. Um, from here, let's go ahead and use Fluffy Buffer to try to get as much HP back as possible. I'm going to use Fluffy Buffer again. And then you only have 5 HP, so we're, we're fine. We're fine here. So you're dead. And that's combat here in the world of Super Bullet Break. So you can see it's very simple at a glance, but there is a degree of strategy here, especially when you consider there are so many other cards that you can collect that really kind of change how combat works. All right, so now we just defeated that encounter, and now it's time for us to select a reward. And once again, this is so important to games like this. What rewards do you take? Which rewards do you skip? What do you discard? It's all super important here. Um, so I think... Choose and discard. Oh, you cost 15, Hawkeye? Hawkeye costs 15. I'm gonna go with Squeaker here. Brand new battle card or bullet as they call them in this game. Add it to the deck and here we go. So what I wanna do, I wanna give you guys a nice taste of all the different nodes here. Um, so here's Shannon. Um, you can go into town and talk to people. Um, I don't, ah, oh, dude, I, I don't have enough gold to even interact with her. So I just have to run away. Hey, why are you running? 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 <laughs> I love that meme. <laughs> so sometimes you can't really do anything, right? Sometimes you have something that they want. Sometimes you don't. And that's kind of how these games work. I'm going to go for this little randomize. We're going to go for the center, of course. That's going to give me a little bit of Giga, which is the game's uh, currency. Now I have 55. So here's a problem. If I go over here and grab this coffee, that'll give me a heal, but then I gotta fight that two-star battle encounter, and I'm not sure if I want that. So let's just do a basic battle here. We're gonna go a lot faster in this one um, because now you guys kind of have the basics here. Now, this is my first time seeing Squeaker. Let's go ahead and give you a shot. Now, Squeaker has a little gimmick which builds up like a, a music combo meter. And when it gets maxed out, something happens. What's that something, FG? Dude, I don't know. I just got her. You saw me. <laughs> I'm going to try to build up some armor and some shield here to try my best. We're going to go ahead and use Fluffy Buffer, get an HP going. Um, all right, so that's the last turn. Let's end the turn with Marcel. Nice, chunky 12 damage. Very nice. He still did enough damage to go through all of my shield as well as my armor um you have no much pretty much you're pretty much dead here so i wanted to get one little heal there down you go battle complete let's see what type of goodies we get here got some more gold and then here we go heart explosion plus 20 gain five shield and more combo beam you know what let's go all combo beam in this one gonna take another combo beam character here because I want to see what that whole combo is all about <laughs> I really do love a good music waifu so we're gonna figure that out here live on today's video all right so we got you knocked out um, I can go to the store but I think I'm gonna save it for right now let's do another fight I'm gonna go into that castle and talk to an NPC in the next one let's see let's go fluffy buffer heal um, shield for sure, sure. And then we're going to go armor because I can't really shove another turn in here. We'll go armor there. Just try my best to not take any damage, dude. All right. Um, from here, Marcel, of course, is always going to go last. This is game five shield. Get that combo dance meter going. <laughs> um... And I guess we'll just go ahead and do an AOE attack, kill you, and start focusing on this last guy. Do 10 damage. That's insanely annoying. We go Haru, get some armor there, six armor. What we can do, three and four. Let's go ahead and drop some cards here. This is going to be a little 
We're going to go ahead and drop one of our Marcel cards. The one that's going to do nine damage next turn. And then we'll go ahead and do Marcel. That's 11 damage. That's going to hurt. We're down to 50 HP on our main character. Um, you're going to do a nice little 12 damage. That's going to be a GG. There goes Fluffy Buffer. I needed you just one turn sooner, my dude. <laughs> but we got a good amount of gold here. Um, let's see. Spawns an attack drone. That might be pretty helpful. Do, 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 do. Gain five armor at the start of combat with that legendary passive. Absolutely yes. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Now, some of these cards, they're the same waifu, but they have different passives. And those passives have different rarities. So you always want to pay attention to even cards that you already have, right? Ah, Shannon again! <laughs> Buy a potion for 30, lose 50. Buy treasure tra tracker? Uh, what is that? Allows you to see inside lock boxes. Dude, what a waste of money, Shannon. Dude, that was such a bad move to burn all my money right before the shop. But as you guys can see, um, different items that you can buy. This is going to enfeeble your foes, restore HP, cause confusion. Um, you can gotcha for characters if you want. Once again, no microtransactions. All of the gotcha tickets are going to be available in the game. Um, but I have nothing. I have nothing. So, so we're out of here. <laughs> and we're going to go to this little fight over here. And let's get it on. Two little guys here, not a big deal. Once again, let's get this, uh, oh dude, that's cost so much to cast you. So let's go Haru first, get the shield going, and then we'll go Squeaker to get this combo meter rocking. And there goes the new card that we just grabbed. Here she is right over here, draw three, burst five. Dude, that's actually pretty legit. But, dude. Okay. No more. I can do one more little turn here. That'll kill you. Such an overkill, though, doing nine damage for that. Should I do a burst? I am going to do a burst. We'll do a burst. That's 11 damage. I'm going to get smacked in the face pretty hardcore. But this turn, let's go Fluffy Buffer. That's a five point heal. Another heal. All they did was just kind of delay the inevitable, however, and then you're done. All right. So we've come to the end, my friends, and I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not really sure on how uh, how well this battle is going to go. Um, discarding this bullet grant. Ooh, very nice. So we're going to grab her because Dinky Devil allows us to discard. So if we discard Rico, discard this bullet grant's 10 shield. When you discard this bullet gain 10 armor, bruh. That is what you need. Okay, okay. All right, so from here, I'm going to go ahead and do a 50%. Ooh, swap cartridge. What will it be? <laughs> no, let's do the heal. Let's do the heal. <laughs> All right, okay, we're good. All right, so here we are, final boss. Do I have what it takes to defeat this encounter now? Um, I guess we'll see. So first things first, let's go ahead and start gaining some armor here. Do a ton of damage. Lots of armor built up. We're going to get Squeaker going with that combo action. Um, Draw three, burst five. That's so, so good, dude. I'm going to go Fluffy Buffer for a heal. Ooh, there goes the discard. Can I do it? Oh, I can't do it before my turn's up. <laughs> dude, I'm getting hype. All right, look at this, dude. Burst five. So she's about to do 19 damage once again based on how many cards I played before I played her. So I did tons of damage there. And she only she's so cheap, too. So that allows me to sneak in just one more turn, which I think we're going to go for a heal just to top us off. Okay, so the boss only did a shield there. So check, check, check this out. So Dinky Devil, remember this one? Choose to discard a card from my hand. I'm going to go ahead and discard you, which as far as I can tell, 10 shield, 10 armor, multiple gigas earned from this battle. And if I win, I'm going to get a ton of gold. So a lot of armor. Dude, this might be the run, dude. <laughs> it might be the run. All right, all right. Chill, 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 chill. Um, lots of armor, lots of shields. I'm going to save my discards. Should I? How about I do Dinky Devil? 
We dropped the expensive Haru. And then we do a burst for 13. Good damage, good damage. The music is pretty hype as well. Oh my gosh, she hit. Okay, she hits really hard. <laughs> she got through all of my shielding and was still able to smack me in the face for freaking 16 damage. I don't want to. Let's use the net and try to do some draw. Can we draw? Okay, okay. Looking good. Calm down, FG. You calm down. All right, Dingy Devil for the discard. Um, discard Rico. There goes the tin shield, the tin armor. Um. <laughs> I guess we'll go for burst damage. We're gonna start going uh, all in on damage. I, I guess she did a tin heal, which I'm actually okay with. Um, whatever this combo meter is, we're going to keep continue building that up. Once again, there's a maximum that once you hit that maximum, something happens. What it is, I don't know. But something happens once you do. So I'm going to keep on trying to drive it up the best I can. Okay. So once again, we got... Dude, this burst right here is so, so good. And her turn is so far away. So fluffy, fluffy... Just get as many heals as possible. This doubles my current shield. I have to go for it. So now that is really, really good. Some more fluffy. My burst is going to be insane, bruh. Can I get another draw? So maybe I can find someone cheaper? Yes, we can. <laughs> fluffy buffer once again. And we got no more turns left except for my... Dude, look at this. Cost one... 34 damage to the face. Cool, cool, cool. And then just for... Oh, I can do another burst for Marcel for 15. Or do I want to continue building up my combo? Forget that. We're, we're, this execution range, baby. We're going all in. We're going all in. The strategy has been thrown out of the window. We are just trying to do as much damage as possible. Forget all this nonsense. Um, this is double my shield, right? So I need to use some shield cards. Ooh, her turn is coming up real quick. Coming up quick, real quick. All right, we'll just go shield. She did a heal, which is okay, actually. I'm totally fine with her healing. Um, go fluffy buffer. There goes a burst card, beautiful. Let's go for a draw. I'm getting greedy. The greed was the greed has paid off. Uh I can't I can't discard. I can't get a discard without triggering her turn, unfortunately. Um oh wait! It's over! I got lethal! <laughs> 10 HP, I got 11 damage, battle complete. That is the first chapter complete on my friends. Very, very nice. And then um, oh, let's take a look here. So once again, like I was telling you guys earlier. You can get the same exact card with different passives. So this right here has a common passive, only gain one shield, meh. But the same exact character here, um, if you have 12 or more monochrome bullets, that's basically a style type. Think like swimsuit, Halloween, Christmas. There's a type of waifu called a monochrome bullets in this game. Um, inflict three delay on all enemies on your turn. Ooh, a delay is pretty good. Cost minus two? Cost minus two? <laughs> I'm gonna take that then. Very nice. So there goes the boss. He is now in my deck. Very, very cool. And that is a nice little run here in the world of a super bullet break. Not a bad little title, man. <laughs> you can see I started to get a little hype on that one. Um, so just like in any of these games, right, as you might expect, it's going to get slightly more difficult. Um, I say let's go for one more little battle encounter here. Let me see what this little NPC is going to be. Oh, lady, calm down, woman. <laughs> I had to click that off quick, real quick. All right, chill, chill, chill. So it's like the same stage, but nighttime. But I'm starting to get real good at this game, I feel like. <laughs> so check this out. Uh, what we'll do, smack you in the face, that's twice, with that lower cost, which is great. J burst five, very, very cool. Um, plus getting that extra little bullet action there. 
10 shield, 10 armor, looking good. I can actually kill you before you even take a turn, which is great, right? So you die, I'm doing 10 damage, right? That's gonna take you out, that's eight damage, you're done. My turn continues to keep going, so I can keep on running my burst meter. Um, then I'm gonna smack you in the face with a 19 point burst, sucker. Oh, bootleg mimic. Um, from here, once again, I'm sorry about the whole combo beam thing. We, we never figured it out. <laughs> we, we never figured it out. My bad. Uh, let's see. Oh, dude, that was a lot of uh, HP lost there. Um, I'm gonna go shield. Lots of shields, actually. I can go ahead and do two shield moves there. I can go ahead and double my shield. I still got a turn left as well. Um, oh, you only have seven, so that's gonna be GG. Battle complete. Dude, I feel like I can play this game all day, but I got stuff to do. Um, so that's Super Bullet Break, dudes. I hope you guys enjoyed. I really enjoyed this little game. So if you don't mind, you know, dropping a 20 for a game like this, 160 waifus, no microtransactions, pretty fun gameplay as well, and a pretty satisfying gameplay loop, right? Just like Slay the Spire, the more you play, the more tools and more goodies you get to play with, right? Um, so let's see. Um, once again, gives me more gold at the end of battle. 1.5, that's so, so good, though. Heal two times, gain eight armor. It has to be one of these because both of them have a legendary passive. I mean, I can always skip the battle reward, but I don't wanna. <laughs> I don't wanna do it, dude. We'll go with that. I love I love these gold ones right here because it, it'll make my, my life so much easier when it comes to paying off these NPCs and buying things out of the shop. Um, let's go over here. Isn't this video over, FG? You're over. <laughs> We're talking about me. You over. All right, check it out. Uh, let's go. Lots of shields. Let's go ahead and build up that burst meter. Already going ham. Ah, I can't get another turn in, unfortunately. So let's go with the 14 damage there. Very, very nice. Got another burst going here as well. Inflicts two bound. Ooh, it's kind of like a little... Uh, a little bound. <laughs> What's it like, FG? You know, it's like a, like a little bound, you know? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> um, I can actually do an AOE here. Do an AOE here. That Oh, dude, I messed, I messed that up. I was not looking at how much damage. Dude, I should have ended the video. <laughs> I should have ended it. I messed up, dude, the misplays. <laughs> All right, guys, I am out of here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Not a bad one. Later.